Welcome back to the shop. In the previous media blasting video, I demonstrated the two-stage blasting process where we used a cleaning abrasive and then we used a glass bead to obtain the results on these parts here. You saw how very effective the two-stage process is. In this video, I want to demonstrate the ultra efficiency of this upgraded cabinet. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use a little less than one cup of number seven glass bead. And I'll show you there's no camera trickery, that the cabinet's completely cleaned out, there's no media in it. And we're going to blast this aluminum part. It has a machine surface, it has a factory surface on it. It's clean, so we're going to omit the cleaning number 75 glass abrasive process for this demonstration. I also want you to take note at how efficient the vacuum system works. You notice there's virtually no dust. If you go back to the previous video, you'll see through that whole blasting process, we had a very clear view of our parts. That's because of the very efficient vacuum system and the flow meter adjustments, where it's just removing dust and not a media. That's very important for efficiency because once we blast for several minutes with the one cup of glass bead, we're going to recover everything that's left in the cabinet. And you'll see that most of the material will be here and not end up in the vacuum. So let me take you over to the cabinet, show you that the cabinet's all cleaned out, and let's mash that pedal and do some demos. You can see I have the metering valve cap removed, and we're going to back purge the gun. You see we have no MIDI in the cabinet at all. For this demonstration, we'll be running 25 PSI during the whole demo. You can see that's a Pyrex cup of a little less than one cup of number seven glass bead. We're going to add the one cup. Our metering valve setting is full lean, full open.
Now we will sweep the glass bead down into the hopper adapter and drain it out and see how much we have left. Okay, let's drain the media and uh, back flush the gun. Oh boy, did I just make a mess. Back flush the gun. Okay, I got most of the mess. There's a little bit left on the floor, but let's take a look at the part and how much media we have left. So you see we have just under a cup, almost exactly where we were when we started. That's ultra efficiency right there. So there you have it once again. The proof is in the pudding. Very ultra efficient operating blast cabinet. In upcoming videos, since I demonstrated the two stage blasting process and how efficient the cabinet is, now I'm gonna show you how performance wise it is and what it can do to different parts. So stay tuned, until next time, see ya.